Hey Siri, pause. Alright guys, undead stocking the Stussy pennies today. They look crazy on feet. Low-key, I might go back for the all-black pair and try and step out of my comfort zone, but overall these ones, A1 steak sauce. What's up? All right, you guys, so breaking down the first fit of this vlog, this is very similar to something I think I wore in the last outfit vlog, but we do have a needles flannel on, uh, one of my favorite pickups from last year, Operation Rally t-shirt underneath, some minimal twill cargos, like with the flare at the bottom, and then the Stussy pennies. I'm gonna break down the Stussy pennies and how I feel about them, but low key, you guys, this shoe on feet, A1, really love them, they look good. Good morning everybody, day two of the vlog. I just wanted to add real quick that yesterday when I wore these Stussy pennies, I was just very, very excited and they look amazing on feet. I feel like this silhouette is just very slept on and um, I feel like a lot of people will catch on to these very, very late. But overall, these looked fire on feet and I really loved how they looked and they also were very comfortable. I love these so much that I might consider doubling up on them or even just buying the all black pair and just trying to rock those. Um, but overall, shout out to Stussy, man. These shoes are fire. But this morning, we're going to go ahead, drop off all these packages. I just truly want to thank everyone who showed love on the last drop. Thank you guys so much. You guys are like making my dreams come true. It truly does mean a lot when you guys show support. So if you did purchase something from the Flake Studios drop or even the Flakes Closets drop, Thank you guys so much. It truly does mean a lot. And uh, we're going to head to the post office, drop this off um, today. Today's outfit's kind of kind of just very, very quiet, I guess you can say. Have a feature hoodie on top um, and then some dicky cargo pants with some Margellas on feet. Kind of simple, but we'll figure it out, you know? I'll show you guys the full breakdown later. Shout out to this USB for letting me roll this out to my car real quick. What a great way to start off a nice little Monday. Your boy does open at work today, so I have to head over to the feature. Head over to the feature. Head over to feature at the win. Probably grab some Earth Cafe coffee just because I don't have time for Starbucks. But thank you guys for all the support as far as what goes on on the channel, even Flake Studios on Instagram. I really, it's really crazy to me how like I'm able to be doing the stuff I'm doing. Um, and I just truly appreciate you guys. So thank you so much for all the support you guys. Um, and we're only going to try and keep going from here. If you guys did miss out on the first drop of Flake Studios, like your size sold out, I will be working on a restock very, very soon. So make sure to stay tuned for that. But maybe I shouldn't be vlogging and driving. All right, quick outfit breakdown. Just let me remind you, it is a Monday. So very chill vibes today. Breaking down the Monday fit real quick. I have a feature Nike hoodie that I made in Utah. Uh, it's kind of just like a screen print or heat press type of hoodie. Some Dickie cargos from Amazon and then the Margella replica sneakers on feet. Nothing too crazy, just a Monday vibe. Happy Monday, y'all. All right, gotta head to work, grab some coffee. Just got home from work. Cool little packaging right here. Take it in real quick. I need to invest in a nice little tripod or like a mini one because I always I have you guys on some Tupperware right now. But um, we just got home, got this package in. I wanted to show you guys what I picked up from this collection. I feel like this one was really dope. Um, I really love the bottoms in this collection. I feel like they killed it. And I bought two pairs of bottoms coming out to like $200 or like 180 after shipping. The box though, I do appreciate good packaging. So it does say Zara, Ruigi, pretty cool. And then you do have like nice little paper. Higher end on the Zara end, not just tossing it in a nice poly bag. But I did grab a pair of the cargo pants in a size small medium. I didn't get to try these on, but when I did see these in store, they look absolutely massive. So I feel like hopefully this small medium does fit me. Um, low key, I don't think it will because the waist size, which kind of sucks. I didn't really think about that. And then uh, we did grab the nice tan pair in a nice size large. So yeah, there you guys have it. These are my two pickups. I don't think this one's gonna fit me, but we shall try it out. But just cause the medium large just look massive in the store. 
But maybe that was the whole purpose of them. I don't know, I feel like I already took yeah, it out. So it's in the morning time now, we have some better lighting. I might as well show you guys these pants. So this one retailed at $90. The black pair was a little confusing because when I saw these in person, the large, extra large look massive. Like I didn't even want to try them on because they look humongous. So I don't know, this one is a size small medium. They fit me perfectly. They're a little tight on the waistline, but as far as like the length and the bagginess of this pant goes, it fits me perfectly other than the waist being very, very small. So I might have to go ahead and like try and do some like tricks to go ahead and make that fit. But with the tan pair, I purchased a size large, which is me sizing up just because I did want a little bit of a baggier fit. When I tried these on in store, they did fit me perfectly. Um, this one retailed at 80, the black pair retailed at 90. Um, and then I'll go ahead and toss them on for you guys right now, show you guys how they look. Low key, I feel like this black pair would look perfect with the, with the Stussy pennies. Um, so yeah, I feel like this would be a really good outfit. So here's how they fit. This is the black pair in a size small medium. I feel like a large extra large would have been too big, but look how cold they look with the Stussy pennies. I feel like they look really, really good. Let me know what you guys think about these pants. I know I'm not really doing them justice by just showing them through a mirror, but overall, Good cop in my opinion. Just gotta figure out the waistline thing. All right, you guys, I tossed on the tan pair with the pair of Sambas. I don't know how I'm gonna rock this color pant, but I did need something kind of like this in my rotation of pants, so you guys let me know. They're kind of a little bit like too cream. I wish these were more like khaki-ish, I guess, but I can't complain. They look fire. Yeah, so there's a size large. Rude Zara Cargos. <clears throat> so I have my morning voice. So I haven't washed up, but I just wanted to try these on for you real quick. Let me know what you guys think down below in the comment box. They do have like the nice little altering on the side. You guys know me, I love pants that have that option. But overall, they look good. Hey guys, I wanted to show you guys an Instagram photo, um, I guess behind the scenes of it. Right now I'm gonna go ahead and shoot a nice little like rotation photo. I'll probably take it over there in the kitchen, but this is my current rotation. This is what I've been wearing a lot in February, so Union 4, Off Noir, really love these a lot. Wore them recently. Uh, these I wore to Utah and I just really love this shoe right here. It's probably one of my favorite shoes in my collection. Um, the replicas, really good like daily. Really goes with a lot. I love this Margiela replica sneaker. If you guys don't know, the replica is the name. I didn't buy reps, it's the name of the shoe, okay? So there you guys have it. There's that. Um, the Salmons, I've been loving as well. Just recently did a video on these. Peep that if you haven't watched it. And then last but not least, this is a shoe that I feel like it's just making me love sneakers again. Stussy pennies in the nice cream colorway. They look so good on feet, it's ridiculous. Um, and I just feel like they look so good that I actually really want to double up. But um, I know I don't really like wear my double ups like that, but we shall see, man. This shoe right here, chef's kisses on this one. With the bell Here's the layout, two of my favorites up front, some older things that still attract attention. And then a Margiela, nice little daily shoe. Um, I put the two ones in front just because I know like these are two newer shoes or two shoes that kind of go crazy on Instagram. So um, I don't know, you guys kind of have to like play it out, I guess you can say. Overall, I feel like this will come out to be a nice photo. You guys asked for behind the scenes on Flake Studio stuff. I did show a couple of clips earlier in this vlog, but I do have the navy blue hats coming very, very soon. Don't worry y'all, we'll curve the brim, make it look nice. I promise they'll come up very, very clean. Um, but I wanted to give you guys an outfit breakdown. Today's Tuesday, kind of just light today, you know, daily fits. UNLV feature hoodie, some green cargos, potato vans on feet, or the Imran potato vans, the new schools. Um, yeah, and then I also have, shout out to Toto Designs for this bracelet. I've been wearing them a lot lately, so yeah. Love these bracelets a lot. Bam! All right, so a goal of mine this year was no gatekeeping 2023. A lot of you guys may have reached out in the past asking me like what embroidery shop that I do I go to in Vegas. Um, it's called Embroidery Plus. I feel like it's very important to like test out different embroidery shops, but this one is the one that worked for me. We're going to go ahead and walk in there right now um, and drop off these hats. Flake Studio Series Part 3 when it comes down to the B hats. Super excited for you guys. Um, but yeah, we're here. Embroidery Plus for those asking. And um, we're going to go drop off these hats right now. All right, you guys. So five minutes, seven minutes later, whatever it took. 
dropped off the hats, explained how I wanted it again. Um, I've worked with them in the past, so it's a little easier, but overall, you just have to have like good communication and just like let them know your vision. Even bring in a, a sample of something. Like when I first dropped my uh, Flake Studios hat, I brought in a Kill the Hype hat and kind of showed how I wanted it to be like. Yeah, so shout out to Embroidery Plus. Hopefully those do come in very, very soon. And then right now we're gonna head to the mall uh, with the homie Rashawn and then check out some vans that they just dropped. So stay tuned for that. Um, yeah, shout out Rashawn, man. Good, yeah, buddy. You ready? Oh, let me think I got the whole thing. <laughs> All right, we reached our destination. I wore these vans for a reason. Hopefully they have them in store, but we'll see. All right, guys, do you see it? They're literally the same. That is so crazy. Oh, yours, your stripe got the little like stick in there too? Yeah. What? Bro, oh, the on the back, huh? Bro, they're literally the same. Oh, don't worry, that bro, is crazy. Look at the price though. Your boy paid like three for his. Sheesh. <laughs> what is this? Oh. Yours, yeah. this one's a uh, leather. All right, break it down for us, bro. What? No, I, this, this is just like off the top of my head what I saw on yours <laughs> and then what I saw on these. All right, we're going to do a full video comparing these, but I'm going to invest in the channel and just buy these hoes. I need to stop talking like that. These are tough. The blue joints kind of go crazy. With the blues? Damn. You can't really go wrong with $75, though. You can't. I didn't, I didn't see myself buying these today. <laughs> <laughs> Are you gonna buy them? Uh, we'll, we'll sit on it another minute. One minute later, bro. <laughs> Get the SpongeBob cue. Mission was a success. We're about to head to work. I will show you guys these when we are off, which is right, So we just got home. Obviously, you guys saw me pick up these vans, and I wanted to just give you guys a quick breakdown. Sorry for the noise, but uh, with tax and everything, this shoe right here did come out to $81, which is just a little crazy. We're going to go ahead and compare them. So if you guys don't know, this is the Ayn Rand Potato Vans. Um, you have the logo on the back, logo on the tongue. And then this is the new school, which is just the same exact shoe, just no Potato Vans branding. So as you guys can see, the back is different. Um, but overall, a lot of you guys did reach out about this shoe right here when I did try them on and put them on our outfits and everything. If you guys wanna see a styling video with literally the same shoe, Go ahead and check that one out. But yes, Vans did re-release these, which is just crazy. Um, I did pay like around $300 for these right here. Um, and yeah, they're a little expensive, but it is crazy to see that Vans re-release these. $75, I'm super excited for the regular consumer who wants these. I'm not even salty that I paid resale for my pair. But the only difference is, is the branding. The laces are a little bit thinner and then um, the insole is not as cushiony. But really, you guys are just getting the same exact shoe. So if you guys are interested in the new school Vans, make sure to go ahead and cop them. I'll link them down below. Pretty much the same exact shoe. Go ahead and use the link down below if you guys are interested in copying them. $75, you really can't go wrong with that. Um, I just really love the shape of the new school and I just really love how they look on feet. These are super sick. Go ahead and check out the past styling video if you guys are interested in it. But yeah, that pretty much wraps it up for today's vlog. Smash the like button for me. Subscribe if you guys are new here. I really appreciate you guys selling out on the Flake Studio stuff. Um, and then also just like showing love, 20K subscribers. It does mean a lot. So thank you guys so much. I'll catch you guys in the next vlog. TikTok, Instagram, everything you need will be linked down below in the description box. Catch y'all. Y'all have a good one. Peace.